Hey everyone, how's it going? I'm back with another video. This time I'm gonna be doing a video on pizza, as you can tell from the title already. But what I didn't include in the title was that this pizza is actually made out of cauliflower, the crust. So this is my first time trying it. I'm already missing a piece because I gave my dad a slice so he can try it. Um, I'll put the box somewhere around here. And I got it at Walmart in case you're wondering. That's where I saw them in the frozen section where all the frozen pizzas are. It smells so good. Yeah, this smells so good. So, which one should I get first? First, one's gonna be enough. More pepperoni? Yes, please. This is what it looks like. The crust was already like dark, kind of burnt, so it's like even darker now. So it's, I didn't burn it, that's just how it looked. But yeah, let's give it our first bite. Oh my god, I'm so excited! Wow, I thought I forgot my napkin, it's right here. That's the first time I do a cheese pull on here. Hmm. Not bad. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> it's not bad. The only thing wrong with it is that it's it's a little salty, but lately everything I eat is salty. Everything I eat, everything I cook, I'm like, it's salty, it's salty. So I don't know if it's just me. But I think it's a little salty. But the crust is pretty good. Like, you know, there's people that say, no, it's not good. It tastes like ass, it tastes nasty. And other people are like, oh my god, this is the best thing ever. So I was like, I need to try it. I want to see what I would think about it, you know? See if I would like it. So, just a little pepperoni. But yeah, I wasn't planning on making a video. And every time I go to Walmart, I would like go by the freezer section and I would be like, you know, I would see these. And then in my support group on Facebook, Everybody was talking about oh the cauliflower pizza and they would put a picture up and I'm like I need to try this pizza because I don't eat pizza anymore Which is funny because When I first had my surgery, I don't know if you guys remember I made a freaking pizza hut video I Started off eating bad food when I first got my surgery, so If you guys are in the process of getting bariatric surgery follow the rules I mean, I still lost like 166 pounds. Oh, I went from 400 to right now I weigh 232. But because I've been like really watching what I've been eating since like a few months ago. So, I mean, in the beginning you lose a lot, but then towards the end, like it kind of gets harder. Like right now I'm stuck and I can't lose anymore. So... <clears throat> Yeah, I try not to eat pizza or bread. Like, I'm very low carb, so this, I think, is a really good alternative to pizza. You know, like, if you're trying to be, you know, healthy or you're trying to do, like, the whole keto diet thing. Keto. Keto. I would recommend this pizza. Because it's not bad. It really does take, like, that craving of pizza. Like, you feel like you're eating actual pizza. It's just a little salty. You know what I mean? But... So I saw it and I'm like, I'm going to buy it. Finally, after so many months, I'm like, I'm going to try it. And here I am trying it with you guys. But, yeah. Only thing missing is like some ranch or something. I don't have ranch though. So, how are you guys? I always feel like I talk about the same things <laughs> when I come on here. Like, How are you guys? How's the weather? <laughs> but, um, yeah, so, Happy New Year. <laughs> Wait, have I even made a video this year? I don't even remember. But, I hope your year is starting off really good. Um, Valentine's Day already passed. I hope you had a good one with your loved one. Uh, see this elephant back here? My boyfriend gave me that. 
and some flowers and some chocolates, but I gave my chocolates to my kids. But yes, you know what? Even though I'm not present, I mean not present. Even though I don't make videos anymore, I'm very much present in this channel. <laughs> like I watch a lot of mukbangers. I watch. What do I watch? I watch Madison Mukbang. I recently started watching Divine Munchies. I know they're all they're both vegan, but oh my god, watching them like cook and make their food and eat it like almost tempts me to want to be vegan just because their food looks so good i mean i never will be not that there's anything wrong with it but i'm just very meaty <laughs> no not meaty not me but like i just love meat i can't live without meat so but yeah i have tried some vegan stuff though like some vegan chicken what was it chicken patty and then like a vegan hamburger patty that was like made with beans and i don't know what else I mean, it weren't bad. It wasn't bad. But um, let's see, who else do I watch? I watch uh, Angela Eats. And on these channels, I don't really comment. I'm just kind of like silently watching. But I watch you guys. I also watch... Um, Lexi Babe. There you go. I also watch her. I watch Megan McCollum. Uh, Pink ASMR. I started watching her. I still watch Sweetie Snacker. Oh, uh, let's see. Oh my god, you know who I watch? I watch this <clears throat> guy named Prumir. Or like Prumir. He says Prumir. But he's like an ASMR. Uh, he makes ASMR videos about eating. And oh my god, every time he eats, I swear to god, I want to eat what he's eating. Like, I think he's probably my favorite right now. Him and then there's other this other girl. I don't know her name. I'll put like a little picture of her right here so you guys can see her. But I watch her. They upload like every day, so I watch them like every day. And like at nighttime, when it's my alone time, I'll lay in my bed and I'll be watching those videos. Even though sometimes I'm like, I want some, but I can't. Let me drink my milkshake or my protein shake. I mean, are you making a video? Yes. My son. Oh, can I see you I can see him through the bottom of my door. But yes. So, that's pretty much what I do. Watch mukbangs. I stay home with my kids. I don't work. You know, I mentioned a long time ago that I didn't work at the motel anymore. And people are like, oh, you know, I miss your motel stories. I'm not going to lie. Till this day, I've been trying to think of what other stories I can tell you about the motel. And nothing comes up. And then the ones that I do think of, I'm like, I already said that. Like, I already told that story, so. And I I've, I've get a lot of messages asking me, where's my sister? How come she, well, I'm not uploading with her no more? And if are we going to make videos again? My sister, she has a job. She's a man manager at a retirement home. I, I don't know if I mentioned this here on my Spanish channel. If you don't know, I do have a Spanish vlog channel. It's called Yudi Sanchez Vlogs. I always put it on the bottom. <coughs> But she works like double shifts. She is never home. Like she barely gets home at night. You know, she spends time with her family. She has to cook and all that. So she's very busy. I, cause people ask me why, why, why aren't you gonna make videos with her? And I'm like, whoa, you know? And why can't? There is no time to make, she even works on the weekends. Like that's how busy she is. So I just, I don't have time. I mean, she doesn't have time to make videos with me no more. And I have mentioned it to her. I'm like, man, I wish I could just make another video with you or like we could still make videos, but I can't <laughs> you know she's she has a job now and you know before she didn't work so I could always go over and just make a video but not anymore like in the time that she does get off she spends with her family you know I'm not gonna tell her let's make a video when she gets a day off like every two weeks you know what I mean so yeah that's why my sister isn't on here anymore my husband well he's my boyfriend but i call him husband because when you mexican and you move in together that's your husband you marry now even though you didn't really go like sign but yeah so sometimes i'll say my boyfriend sometimes I'll say my husband because people will be like is he your husband or your boyfriend he's my boyfriend but i call him my husband now that that's out of the way <laughs> um he's gonna be making videos with me too like we've been kind of like planning some things 
like right now we just don't make any videos just because i don't know it's just like i'm just in a mood right now that i just don't like want to come on here and make mukbangs you know what i mean like today i felt like making one because this was new and i was like oh you know i want to make a video like i actually got excited about it and i remember that when i used to watch videos i'm like who's a good example hmm. wendy's eating show i loved her channel so much she would upload every day and all of a sudden she was gone bye bye wendy no more videos for like ever right now she'll upload once in a while and i remember i would always say why do youtubers like upload all these videos and then all of a sudden they bounce they're gone and i was like oh my god i'm like i'm doing the exact same thing you know i started off all yeah but see my reason is that i had the whole bariatric surgery so i can't i've already explained to you guys i can't make those videos anymore like eating to me is not fun so much anymore because you know i take a few bites and I'm, I'm full so and it's like how am i gonna make a like a two minute video you know what i mean so i mean i have my reasons on why i stopped uploading and she's not the only one there's like i think eat with chunky also stopped filming for a while and like she'll upload once in a while she just had a baby and it's not just them it's other people that you know would upload and like all of a sudden you don't know nothing about them and you're like what happened you know <clears throat> and i feel like that's kind of what happened with me so but yeah i think the more you eat it the less it tastes good i don't know but hey, if you guys want to try it, like I said, right now everything to me tastes salty. But maybe if you like salty food or maybe my taste buds are just weird. I mean, it's still not like horrible. I'm not saying it's like, oh, it's disgusting. No, it's not bad. You know, so if you, got any, you want to give it a try, go ahead. They're just a little expensive, I think. Like this thing is small. It's like tiny and it was almost $7. And then at this other store, it was like almost $8. And I was like, ooh, I think that's why I never bought them because they were too expensive. Maybe if I just eat the cheese. But yeah. So yeah, that's what's been going on. Um, I can't think of anything else to update you guys on. And then I always say, oh, I'm going to keep this channel active. I'm going to come back and then I never do. But like I said, I do upload almost every day on my Yudi Sanchez Vlogs channel. So if you want to follow me there, I do upload almost every day. So like some of you are like, oh, I can just watch you eat or drink or just talk. Well, I do a lot of talking over there, <laughs> but sometimes a lot of you don't know. And then you'll show up on my other channel and be like, I didn't know you had this vlog channel. And I'm like, yay, I did. I have two other channels. This one, I have another one called It's Yudi Again. And then I have Yudi Sanchez Vlogs. So yeah, just wanted to inform you guys about that. Just the cheese with the pepperoni is so good. Nobody ever calls me. As soon as I start doing something, that's when they call me. It's always those damn 1-800 numbers. I never answered. I don't answer 1-800 numbers. I don't answer numbers that I don't know, even if they're local never answer i always send them a voicemail if they want to talk to me they can leave me a voicemail but yeah so yeah i gave my dad a slice and i wanted him to try it because my dad has diabetes so we try to watch what we eat and i kind of like tell him okay this is good this is bad and then i gave him a piece of this and i'm like you need to try this and tell me what you think and he liked it and he's like it's good but like I said, the first few bites are good, and then after that, como que it gets more saltier, and you're like, you know what I mean? But yeah, guys, I know this was a really short eating show, <laughs> whatever you want to call it. But uh, I wanted to come back and just show my face. Oh, yes. I'm kind of like trying to talk too loud because my dad and my husband are like right here on the other side of the door. 
so yeah i really hope you guys like this video if you did don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you guys in my next one bye